turrets. What the hell? Um. Hey! Hey! Over here! Research complete. Homo sapiens. <laughs> Humans, like most mammals, possess a low natural psychoactive potential. Attempts to alter brain functions through artificial means are usually temporary at best or harmful and addictive at worst. The addition of redacted, derived from Typhon organisms, temporarily weakened the elasticity of human neuron connections and allows for the addition of new synthetic neurons to catalyze change in the subject's brain. Okay. Removal of this serum will cause the human body to reject the new neurons and connections, effectively resetting the brain back to its original state. This process may result in memory loss and other as of yet undiscovered side effects. You find anything good in that armory? Well, I was going to give you the code, but I guess you don't need it. Still, I sure would appreciate being let out of here. My name's Aaron. Aaron Ingram. Uh, hold on a second, buddy. Most other fellows were Russian. I speak a little, but as you can tell, I ain't from there. As you might have guessed. <laughs> I don't mean to be a nuisance, but when do you think we'll get to that breach? I'm headed out there as we speak. What do you think happened? Hard to say until I lay eyes on it. Could be some micrometeoroids punched a hole. Rare, but it happens. Okay, good. Hopefully it's just that. Is there something you're not telling me? No, of course not. It's just that storage room has classified exotic materials. We really can't have it be inaccessible. Uh, I understand. Oh. Oh my. All right, uh, we're gonna drop you. Dismantle. We're gonna drop you. Dismantle. Great. Oh, Neuromod. Dismantle you. Oh! 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 Woo! All right. Now we are talking. I want a turret. Sure, let me bring this out. Is that everything in here? I think so. Volunteer test subject criminal history approved for viewing. Press request record to view at your discretion. Human trafficking, kidnapping, solicit solicitation of a minor, distribution of controlled substances, fraudulent impersonation. Okay, so this guy's just a piece of crap. Hey. hey. What are you what reading? Are you reading? A, rap a rap sheet, sheet huh? huh? Look, I'm telling you, on my mama's grave, that is a stack of lies meant to make pushing that button easier on you. Okay, fine. Listen, I want to be honest. Some of it probably is true. I've done some wrong in my days, but this ain't right, you know? Come on, y'all got to let me out of here. I never did anything to those kids. I was just getting them out of a bad spot, that's all. Now, the real criminals... They didn't like how I was chipped away at their pile of rubles. They got the claws sunk deep in the government. Got me shipped off to the gulag. That's how I ended up here, see? Whoa. 
I want to see how much he'll talk. Or maybe that's it. Okay, here we go. First of all, come on now, save. Damn it, let me out. First, we're gonna let him out. Now that's what I'm talking about. Some human decency, friend. Now you're the one person who showed me any real kindness, and you can believe I won't forget it. Listen, you run into the other fellas wearing a green jumpsuit? Watch your ass. But they ain't all decent human beings like me. This guy actually seems kind of cool. I seen one of the other volunteers come through here. A big guy. Bastard wouldn't let me out. Now I'm glad he didn't. Watched him bash some poor sucker's head in with a wrench. Kept going on and on about black eggs and whatnot. Real disturbing. I ain't never seen creatures like that. Where'd they get them? The bottom of the ocean or something? Do you think that's a Bioshock reference? Maybe. I'll just lay low for a bit. Plan to ride out of here. Okay, to be honest, I almost don't mind freeing this guy. But of course, we have to see what happens for science. My name's Aaron. Aaron Ingram. Hey, oh, whoa, whoa, whoa! Just what the hell are you doing? What's that thing doing in there, huh? Shit! You! I told you not to do it! Oh, shit! Oh, I bet it's over here, huh? Damn. The truth is discomforting. Every neuromod produced by Transstar contains exotic materials derived from a mimic. If you've been paying attention, you know how mimics get made. Yeah, I'd say. Damn. Um, so, I hate to say it, but I think it's worth killing him. <laughs> I feel bad about this. This is kind of like our... Since we're taking powers, um, this is kind of our... You, I told yeah, this is kind of our dark you know. run. Looks like I don't have a choice because it auto saved. <laughs> you're human. You have a choice. Morgan, did you hesitate at all? 
He's not happy with me. I'm sure he wasn't a good man, but could you have done otherwise, given the opportunity? He is super not happy with me. can only kill and destroy, but you're human. You have a choice. Take the adjustment required. Okay, that worked out pretty well. I'm okay with that. And we got the scan off. Awesome, all right. Well, again, sorry, big guy. That was unfortunate. We're gonna get all this right. Yeah. Oh, and I gotta loot him too, right? Oh, we can't loot him. There we go. Gotta get my veggie blend, y'all. <laughs> gotta get my veggie blend. This item is bothering me. I feel like we're gonna have to do something with this, but I have no idea what. First of all, this music, no thank you. Second of all, how do we open this? Is there like a button on a screen somewhere? Maybe, uh... Maybe in here? No, the guy said that he was gonna, um... No, no, the thing to repair, guys, is a turret. That's not... That's not an enemy. This is just a turret. That's not gonna do anything. We may have to do something with this. But... But what would we do with it? Hmm. Hmm. Oh, this is the area that you think we have to go outside and fix the leak with the meteorites? Uh, I don't know, because I don't see any... I don't see any outdoor area. Material storage subject only. Oh, but she didn't mention... Yeah, she did say that, didn't she? Didn't she? Huh, you're right. Hmm, okay. The guy had the code for the door. Nope, nope, nope. Prisoner was gonna open the armory that we opened. He specifically said, I will open the armory for you. Oh wait, you already opened it when it when he came in, so yeah, that was not the that was not that. Hmm. 
Hmm. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. Let's take one more look and then I guess we'll come back later. One more look around here. There's no, like, big elect electric things, so the grounding resistor wouldn't really do much. There's nothing we can shoot through. Yeah, so I'm guessing this right here was Christine Lloyd. So, if we look at Christine Lloyd's audio log... Okay, really so yeah, that's why it's sealed. Cool. Uh, I understand. No, we didn't miss one of the phantom corpses. I actually think that type of phantom, um, which is, I think it was this one. I think they can split. No, it's, it wasn't a voltaic phantom. It was a etheric phantom. Yes, here we go. Um... The Phantom is capable of manipulating this particulate to create a duplicate of itself for short periods as demonstrated in the test log. That's why we keep seeing two of these guys whenever we fight them. Because they can actually split. And then you're basically fighting two for the same guy. Maybe we'll need this inside of that room when we open it later. So we'll be back. Let's do it. The Gravity Utility Tunnel System, or GUTS, is a microgravity environment used for maintenance and transporting cargo throughout the length of Talos 1. I think this game is setting us up the bomb right now. I think this game is setting us up the bomb. It is preparing us for a giant mind fluff. And I'm looking forward to seeing what it is. Dub's done. There comes a time in every man's life when he looks towards the future, our future eraser marks. Laurel, would you do me the honor of accepting this proposition of effectiveness? Oh, he's trying to write his proposal. Oh, it's adorable. Scientists are so awkward. It's great. Um, let's put you in there. All of you. Work, work. 
Okay, I think we're all set. Perfect. I'm right here. Aw, oh, thanks, buddy. I feel better already. Hi, friend. I was just testing you, chat. I was just testing you. Uh, okay, the electrical fault is still an issue in subsection 19. When will the replacement electrical components be available so I can finally get this repair underway? You understand I cannot leave this subsection offline at all times, correct? Meanwhile, having to navigate around fan vents is not ideal. Parts are on the way. So, it looks like the hint there is that we may have to be looking for some vents to move around in. Microgravity detected. These tunnels run the entire length of the station. Mostly conduit carrying the bare necessities. Power, water, air. But operators also use it to deliver supplies from the cargo bay up to the oh, Given the small number of crew assigned here, I would expect Typhon presence to be minimal as well. But that's probably a bad assumption. I'm going nice. We could go really fast through here. We got a boost and everything. But I'm going nice and slow because I just want to make sure we don't miss anything. How many neuromods do we have right now? Three. Still can't upgrade our. Uh, I really want to upgrade our ability to upgrade weapons. And then we can finally spend, like, what do we have? Six? Eight weapon upgrade things just ready to go. I think we can even make more if we want to. Whoa! Nope! 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 Wait, did it die? What the hell? What happened? I think it, I think it died. Can I loot it? No. Hmm. Not quite sure what happened there. What are you? Bastard. Can complete more specimens required. Sistoy. Cystoid nest. 
The outer layer of each cystoid nest appears to be made of an exceptionally thin layer of the same material that makes up most Typhon. Indeed, the nest appears to be just as fragile as the cystoid themselves, making it less of a protective structure and more like a living mine. It's possible that the weaver uses these to mark and even defend its territory from any kind of intruder. Steer clear unless you want radiation sickness or a swarm of cystoids after you. It's fortunate the weaver produces so many of these because keeping cystoids alive for long outside of those nests has proven to be exceptionally difficult. Despite the lack of any visible sensory organ, each cystoid seems to be capable of detecting us through unknown means detonating on proximity. If we can figure out what to use it to see, we may be able to find a way to blind it along with enough to get a closer look. Now, it looks like once the nest is exploded, um, that we're good. Now, I wonder if we can shoot these things before... Is this another one? This is another one, isn't it? Or is this one we scanned earlier? That's the one we scanned earlier. Okay, so let's take let's do a little bit of experimentation here, see what we can do. We may be able to glue them, but maybe we don't have to. All right, here we go. It's 22 meters away. This gun has an effective range of... 20 meters. Okay, let's get... Right. Research complete. Awesome. See if you got anything new. Attracted to movement. Throw something to distract them. Try to group them up and take them out with fewer shots. Releases a burst of radiation on death. Oh, that's cool. How close? Oh, shit. Well, that didn't work out quite as planned. Can we one-shot him? Yes, we can. Good to know. System offline. Bummer. We're on the hardest difficulty nightmare. Hey, what's up, E. Johns? How you doing, dude? Good to see you. Always a pleasure, brother. Always a pleasure. Oh. Ooh, sneaky. Okay. Boop. Yeah, look at that. Awesome. So all we have to do is throw stuff near them. And it looks like that'll work swimmingly. Let's go ahead and see if we can get some of this stuff real quick. Uh, can we do anything with that? No. Um, but I think there's something down there. Got to keep our ship repaired, bros. Engineer Co. is on the case. Ooh, a mission dampening coil. That sounds fun. Okay, let's take a good look around here before we keep moving. Something. There's a lot of hidden loot in this area. The biggest thing is I want to make sure we don't miss any dead bodies. Because part of our 100% run, part of this run, is going to be finding every single body. That we can. We may get locked out of some due to story stuff. And if that happens, it happens. But look at this. Oh. Secrets. 